I was born and raised here. My grandparents and father lived in the house that we are now in. I spent 72 years in this location. This is my home. And even when I went off to college, I came back here on the weekends. I graduated from East Depot High School. I was in the class of 68. I graduated from Fort Valley State College, which is now Fort Valley State University, in 72. I got drafted in October of 72, and I had a brief stay with the United States military. I was one of the last one to be drafted, and that was during Vietnam. Upon my brief stay with the Army, I went back to my job, which I was working with the Department of Public Health with the state of Georgia. I retired. I was an uh, epidemiology and the community disease unit. I worked with uh, in all infectious diseases for us finding where they originated and try to get make sure that everyone that was in contact with was treated. I have purchased several houses and I spent lots of time rehabbing those houses. I read and I listen to music. Believe it or not, I started off really as a music major. I was thinking about going into music, but social worker was my second choice. So I, I found out that I can help more people with in the, in the field of social work than, than just teaching because that was only been my only added avenue in life would be to teach. Well, I, I'm involved in the church. I attend Warren Temple and Birch Chapel, United Methodist Church at both in, in the city. And I try to work with various units of the church. Like I, I Warren Temple, I work with the, the, the food ministry. And then at Birch Chapel, I was the administrative chairperson. So that kept me busy. I'm involved in various civic and social organization. I'm a member of Cap Alpha Psi Fraternity and our motto is to give back and that's what I've tried to give. I served as advisor to our chapter that was at West Georgia and I was one of the charter members when we got the LaGrange chapter here started. So I, I feel very proud to do that. I'm still here because I love the Grange. And also because this is where I got my start from the Grange. So I like to give back. I like the progress that LaGrange is making, okay? I remember we didn't have any restaurants or anywhere. We had, very, we had to travel to Columbus or Atlanta. The main store here was Mansour's. Well, I like LaGrange one reason because we're situated, we're located between Columbus and Atlanta. So we had a, a choice of going to either one of the, the big cities. But uh, that's what I like. I have rental property that I rent to, and I cater towards elderly people. That's where I feel that I'm giving back to the community. There's not enough housing for elderly people and there's really not no services for them. I'm not in the business to make money. I give back to the elderly by reduced rent. But they really cannot afford it. And here lately, rent has really gone up skyrocket and they are on a fixed income so I, I feel that by me sustaining the cause of them living there and I'm doing something giving back to the community. I'm Carl Cotton and I'm the story of the Grange.